Welcome to Glanstall the Vlog, as we take you behind the scenes in our preparations to retain the Monster School Senior Cup. So sit back, relax and enjoy as we see how the season unfolds. Lads, to win the cup this year, we're going to have to be better than any Glensall team who's ever played before. It's time to go to work. Yeah, amazing year last year, uh, obviously the first cup win in the school's history, so one that will uh, live long in the memory, I'm sure. You know, it was spectacular memories of it and, you know, something that, you know, it's going to be hard to top, obviously, winning the first one. Uh, but nevertheless, obviously, it sets you up, hopefully, to be kind of perennially contending, or that's certainly the hope from us, that we can maintain our, our high levels of the last couple of years. From the starting team last year, we have two players back, uh, which is obviously means we lose 13 players, which is a lot. Um, but that's just the transient nature of schools rugby, you know, you're going to lose a lot of players and, you know, the, the opportunities for new guys to come in, both from a coach to coach these new guys and them to play, it's really exciting. And then we have a lot of guys who would have been involved uh, as replacements and reserves, so guys who have cup experience and have been around uh, cup campaigns that have been successful. Uh, and I think all in there, we've about 10 guys who uh, would have been involved in, 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 in some games during that cup competition last year. So uh, it's both kind of a blend of, I think, new guys coming in and some experience from last year. This season, like, you know, I think we've, we've, we've gone pretty well, you know. Uh, we, we've had a mixed bag in terms of results. Uh, we've played a lot more games this year than we would have last year. Obviously, uh, it's a good position to be in. You have a lot of schools coming to you looking to, to, to play uh, uh, once you've, you've got a high performance trophy in the bag. So I think we've played about 18 games or 19 games at this point. Uh, and we're, I think we've won about 11 or 12. So uh, mixed results at times, but uh, I think I really enjoyed working with the group. Uh, they, they, they're a different team. We have to play a different way. We have to uh, come up with different solutions to, to being competitive. But uh, I think they're in really good shape at the moment. Uh, and really looking forward to the, the first cup game against uh, either Bandon or, or High School Clamell. Up next, Jared's uh, should be a tough game. Uh, look, they're a really good school. Uh, we've had a great uh, relationship with them over the last couple of years. We've played each other in a commemorative trophy, uh, which kind of celebrates the, the unique kind of history and relationship that schools have. Jared's used to be just a, a preparatory boarding school, and a lot of the guys used to come into Glenstall. So uh, we beat them last year, and I'm sure they'll be keen to get some revenge. Uh, hopefully we can retain the trophy that we play for, but it's just a great opportunity to get the guys back in after Christmas and see where we are. Uh, we'll just go through the, the game sheet that I've put up for, for tomorrow's game uh, together, which kind of touches on some of this stuff. Um, but basically, uh, the first thing I think we need to, to focus on is we have to get a big response from all the players involved. So we need to approach the game really well and play well. So it's not just approaching it with the right attitude and turning up mentally right. You've got to play well when you're out there. Like, I don't want coming back on Saturday, Tom ringing me and going, well, you know what, to be fair, the lads actually had a much better mindset for the game. Like, mindset is obviously, like, the minimum we would expect. Would you agree with that collectively? So then what we're going to start critiquing is, well, how effective was our performance in the match? Like, how good were we at our set piece? How good were we on our D? How good were we on our exits? Our restarts, our transitions, our phase play attack, our inside 22 attack. How good was our first phase launches? This is how it's gonna be This is what you think of me It's going down like I told you This is how it's gonna be I'll be the last man standing here I'm not going anywhere It's going down like I told you I'll be the last man standing here
I'm the baddest mother up in here And I'm about to make it clear It's going down like I told you I'm the baddest mother up in here If we keep focusing on the people wanting to improve them, if we keep making the same mistakes all the time, you'll we'll always get what you always got. Okay? Mm -hmm. So as long as we keep wanting to improve, all of us as a group and individuals, <coughs> things will get better.